GM friends, welcome back to my channel. Today I want to talk about Ashfia. It's a project in the modular space. It's actually using Celestia technology. So recently they've had a new project that launched using their technology and there's some actionables. So in this video, I just want to be talk about all of that. And per usual guy, nothing's financial advice in my videos. And I'll put all the links in the description. So the website is astria.org and their twitter is at astria org so i'm gonna get into just before that what they are etc but i just want to go into their funding the funding is quite impressive so they raised 5.5 million from a very good investor i would say their tier one plus investors so you got delphi digital robot adventures you got lemnus cap i've seen them 1kx they invested in quite good uh, projects figment with their big a they're like a, a staking provider they've also got really big backers themselves so yeah so that's i know this is just seed round so that's very good because you know based on how they do they'll probably do better a bigger round later on as we've seen with a lot of projects i've reviewed like even recently babylon chain they raised 70 million and so yeah like when i done the video they haven't raised that much but that's why it's really important to see the raised and you know sometimes just get good vibes and i can tell like some projects are going to raise more money later on based on how they do what is astria so here they've written a very good thread astria is building a sequencing layer for permissionless rollups the sequencing layer is a modular which means that it only focuses on sequencing it does not execute rollup data just orders it on behalf of participating rollups the sequencing layer nodes use comet bft to come to consensus on ordered blocks okay, so who is astria for here you can see yeah i won't read the whole thread because otherwise the video will get too long but um, it's based is in celestia technology and they've actually launched their own product one of the senior devs contributors is actually launches on on top of celestia technology so one of the good thing about this is you're going to be using astria technology and the other technology which will probably make you eligible for multiple airdrops in one go so I'll, I'll introduce the project to you in a bit but here you can see they've partnered with milky way which i've done a video on as well they've been the lido you can call it they're the biggest staking provider liquid staking providers on via, via tvl on celestial network and here you can see astria is actually partnered with them or collaborating with them so that's that's very good because you know legit projects always associate with other legit projects so this is the project that has been launched by Astria's team or one of the contributors to Astria. It's to make to simplify is a chain to 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 launch NFTs and it's for creators. So think of it like Zora chain. So how you have Zora is like an NFT platform and then they launched their layer two on Ethereum. So think of former chain like that is a chain for NFT creators. So here you got the the Twitter handle you got at former chain. And here there's a good thread that explains what former chain is. I can I can read it, but yeah, I'll I'll put the link in the description. But the gist of it is that is so. This is the person that's made it. He's a senior engineer at Astria, and is a co-founder of former chain. Yeah, so that's a good sign because the more use cases there is on a chain, the more likely it's going to get adoption, etc. So on Astria, there's not too much things to do. We're very early, and you know that's that's when you want to interact with projects because that's when you will get the most rewards. So for my chain right now, they do have a minting going on and an NFT mint. I'm going to show you how to do that because it's not very straightforward. And also in a few days, they're going to have another mint. So keep an eye on my telegram. In another video, I'll actually show you last the last week or two weeks, I've been doing a lot of good daily actionables for airdrops. So if you're not following that, you're missing out. So you definitely want to be following that guys. It's free alpha. I'm just giving out there. So what you want to do to mint these nfts on former chain so you want to use this bridge to be bridge to the former chain and what this uses is hyperlane in the background so you're using hyperlane you're using astra and you're using former so you know they all have they all don't have a token so it's like a three in one and so what you want to do is connect your evm wallet so as you can see here i've actually connected my evm wallet a metamask and you want to connect your celestia so first you need to get celestia if you don't have celestia it's pretty much available on all major platforms and exchanges i think if you're in the uk is geo blocked in on binance so you would have to get it from somewhere else but you know if you go atom and cosmos you can just use any decks and then black osmosis and then swap for celestia once you got celestia in your kepler wallet you're going to come on this website and so the mint per nft is 0.5 i just done two because i like to do more than the average if i am doing it so that way like you know if i get any airdrop it should be higher than what because sometimes what they do is 
the bare minimum, they'll probably try to cut it off so that they get rid of a lot of cybers. So that's why I try to do a bit more. So I what I done is I bridged 1.2 Celestia. So 0.2 was like for the fees, etc. And one would go into two NFTs. So what I done, I connected my MetaMask and my Kepler and I bridged over Celestia. And it was done literally in like, like seconds, I believe, if I remember correctly. Next up, what you want to do is come on this website and you want to win. So as you can see, I've minted, I've connected my EVM wallet and I've, the mint price is 0 0.5. So there's very less, there's very less people that have minted this. If you look at a lot of airdrop projects, etc., there is many, many doing them. They're like 50,000, 100,000. There's like so many people farming it. Here, you only have 16,000, which is a good sign. And here, I think this is the min end. So yeah, day left. And also, they apparently, from where I read somewhere else that they're going to launch more NFTs. So you might want to like bookmark this site or this page to see the other new NFTs. Hey guys, I didn't realize there's less time. I thought there's at least two, three days left, but still, I'm, I'm going to upload the video literally within an hour. So there should be around 20 hours still left. But by the time you see this video, so just do the actions straight away. So yeah, then just hit mint and then it's going to be minted. And if you want to withdraw your funds, you go back on that website, click on withdraw, and then connect your wallet. This is your EVM wallet. And then EVM means like Ethereum virtual machine, as in your Ethereum based wallet. So MetaMask. And then the two is your Stride address. So what I realized is I think it's using Stride technology as well. I'm not too sure, but you just hit self and then hit withdraw. So then you'll be on the Stride chain. And then from there, you can use, you know, other tools, withdraw it or, you know, swap it, etc. So and that's pretty much it, guys. And then lastly, per usual, guys, you want to follow Astria Discord, former Discord. We're very early in this one. Like I said, there's got a really good funding. So looking like a good project. And um, just stay active with their socials and follow my Discord and hit the bell notifications because this one, if you watch it too late, you won't be able to, see, able to mint this NFT. You'll probably be able to mint the next one, but this shows that you're early contributor and early participant of the network. So usually those people will get the most rewards. And uh, the NFT is not too expensive. It's like $5 each. So I just done two. But yeah, guys, and that's pretty much it. I hope you got some value from this video and I'll see you on the next one.